energy sector in India has seen enormous transition and more so in the recent years with the newer emerging themes such as electric vehicles, green hydrogen, storage, solar cell and electrolyzer manufacturing. And renewable energy sector in particular has seen significant evolution and growth and is leading the way for sustainable development and creating better future. In line with India's global commitment to climate change and becoming a net zero carbon emitter, Budget 2022 actually provides a unique opportunity to the government to press the pedal and accelerate the pace of development of clean energy. With this backdrop, on the energy sector front, I have the following three asks from the effort. Number one on my agenda is a strong push for green technology. I expect the FM to incentivize R&D and technology adoption in the, in the sector to pave the way for likely JVs, global strategic tie-ups, and promote more investments in these newer emerging themes. It could be in the form of higher corporate tax deductions, reduction in applicable GST rates, or special investment-linked incentives. Secondly, I think the government should consider to defer the levy of basic customs duty on import of modules which is otherwise applicable from 1st of April 2022. One should rather incentivize domestic module manufacturers by enhanced tax concession and subsidies. This would actually help drive global competitiveness for the domestic players without disrupting the current demand supply situation of the modules and generation pipeline. My third ask is in relation to attracting long-term patient foreign capital in the sector. While the last few budgets have set the base by providing specific tax exemptions to sovereign wealth funds and pension funds when they invest in eligible sectors such as infrastructure and energy, there are certain grey areas and interpretation issues when applying the current provisions of law. Rationalization of conditionalities attached to this tax exemption and coming up with specific clarificatory rules is much awaited. That said, Budget 2022 is coming at a time when optimism is coming back. The FM needs to take this optimism further, build on it to create a strong base for the economy by bringing in an investment push budget. Private investments will continue to drive the change and pace of change that India is targeting. I therefore expect the FM to take concrete steps towards creating a conducive and consistently stable investment environment that supports a better, greener future.